This game is T and is not suitable for kids. Hey there, buddy! Well, that was way easier than the horse. <laughs> Gradually, more and more of the guys are showing up here just like, we need to have an intervention. It's about your habit of eating baby carrots. It's going too far. There are other vegetables, you know. Oh. No, wait, that's me. Not the character in this. We're getting more and more of a shadow entourage, though, as this time as time goes on, the more colossi we beat. <laughs> I have something to ask of you. There's a colossus hanging out in the desert now. Thy next foe is... A ruin hidden in the lake. If it was so hidden, how do you know about it? A ripple of thunder looks under- Oh great, a giant fish! Bring it on. Do 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 do. Uh, hey horse. Can you maybe not run up the stairs if we're just gonna go back down the stairs again? Alright, where do we gotta go? Literally the exact opposite direction. Nah, the demon juice is alright. As long as we have it in moderation. Oh, hey, aggro! Thank you for jumping down the stairs for me. Alright. So to this day, I still don't know, like, the difference between the glowy spots on the ground, the shrines, and the chameleons. I know they all do something, but I don't actually know what they do. Also, I think there was another ruin we could pray at around here to potentially get the extra thing. I know one of them, if not all of them, increase our grip meter, which is nice. What am I thinking of the game? It's fun, for sure. Some of the Colossi have been very frustrating, like the horse that I still don't know how to beat it. I used to, I had to use two walkthroughs to figure out how to beat it, and both of them were wrong. Like, I did exactly what both of them said, and it didn't work. I just had to brute force it. I thought they, they said there was, like, one of the, uh, you can pray at this fiends around this area, but maybe not. Thus far, a very pretty game. I like it. Go in the wrong way. Let's head back. Boop -de -boop -de -boop -de -boop -de -boop. So we they want us to head towards the desert when they said there is a lake. Okay. And how are we gonna do that? <laughs> Alright, aggro, ride like the wind. Oh, there are other living things around here besides us and the chameleons. That's good, the ecosystem is not completely out of whack. Oh! I think we're here. <laughs> This definitely seems like the lake that they were talking about. Oh yeah! This is the lake that I just cannonballed into and died immediately. <laughs> At least I think this is where they're... Oh, maybe not. Oh no. There is still a secret here. <laughs> Unfortunately, I don't know Pokemon, so I don't really know what you're talking about, but... I'll assume it's a similar situation. A difficult thing to figure out. So I think the Colossus is probably down here. Yeah, probably amidst all that rubble. Aggro, don't don't sneak up on me like that. Alright, alright, buddy. Alright, we gotta find a way to get down safely, because last time I tried, it just killed me immediately. It's very rude. I know it was like 500 feet down, but I cannonballed. 
and landed in water. That's supposed to, you know, protect me, right? I've heard of Ico. That's the game where you hold hands of another person for like the whole game, right? Seems gimmicky, but I've heard it's good. Okay, how are we going to get down? I mean, the second Colossus was also at this lake, right? This is the same lake. They want... Oh, wait. Is this the wrong lake? Only one way to find out. Come, aggro. Oh, great. See? See, this is why I pulled up YouTube on my phone. So that way... Hey! Why can I not see the bot on my phone? Wait, what the heck? I can only see you on my phone. I can't see the stupid bot. What? Aw, oh, nuh-uh. YouTube, that is the dumbest thing ever. See the... I can't see the bots on the YouTube app either. Then where are the bots coming from? And how do I get rid of them? Oh, we can just do it from here. Twitch doesn't let me do that, but YouTube does. Okay. Well, whatever. As I was saying before the bots came in, there might be a different lake we need to go to. Oh, hang on. There is a shrine over there, and that is screaming that there is a secret there. Aggro! Come on! Yeah, look at that. That is so suspicious. That's just YouTube chat in general. YouTube chat is very far behind. Did that increase my HP? Or does that just refill my HP? Impossible. There are only there's only one lake allowed. I bet there's a freaking chameleon here. There he is. Wait, what? Give me the chameleon. What the heck? It won't let me pick me it up. Still don't know what that does, but... Yeah. Agro. Agro, come here. Okay, yes, this is, again, 
proper way to get on a horse is to climb his butt. Yes, absolutely. <laughs> You're taking too long, Pooh Bear. Time is wasting. <laughs> okay, it's pointing me at a wall. Well, that's always fun. Come on, aggro. It's not that big a deal. You just ran into a rock. So what? <laughs> I don't know if I want to work for Nimrod, though. Actually, I'm pretty sure I should not be working for Nimrod. That did not end well last time. I didn't know if it was the chameleons that increased your grip. I was looking at my grip meter as I grabbed it, and I did not see any noticeable difference. Okay, am I, like, stupid, or is there, like, nothing to do here? Are we... Aggro, run across these rocks. Run! Aggro? <laughs> you will do as I say. Aggro, move faster! Yeah. Aggro, stop prancing around like a fool. Oh, hang on. Okay, there we go, Aggro. Wait, is that another one? Is there, like, just a bunch of chameleons hanging out here? Is Aggro moving faster following me than he was when I was actually riding on top of him? Because that's not cool. I think we're in the wrong area, probably. Like, I don't think this is the lake. <laughs> this is definitely not the lake. It's pretty, but... Wow, that's a big boy mountain. Oh, wait. I thought, I thought you were a chameleon, Butterfly. I'm sorry. I saw black and blue, and I'm like, It's chameleon! Kill it! Did we just move the complete opposite direction? Oh, well, not quite. It keeps pointing me towards walls. It's like, dude, all you gotta do is move through solid stone. It's really easy. <laughs> Pretty much. I don't know the moral standing of my character. I only know my own moral standing. Why don't we get... Can, can I have another teleporty cave that takes me right to the Colossus? That'd be nice. Yeah, you better pull up your pants, bro. Excuse me, has anyone seen a lake? All right, aggro. <laughs> move. I don't want to have to push the triangle button 18 times to make you move the fastest. Oh, hey, it's another shrine. Unless this, this is the exact same shrine that we went to earlier. Does that also increase your grip, or does that just refill your HP? Okay, there's got to be another little lizard hanging out. Ah, there he is! With my 
trusty bow and arrow. I'll shoot you out of the sky. As soon as you appear in a spot where I can actually shoot you. Jump! Jump! Where did that little bugger go? Where'd he go? It's been three thousand years. Where did he go? I'm okay. I'm okay. Don't worry, aggro. I I'm okay. Can't fool me, I saw him. I'm not shooting you, aggro. Calm down. <laughs> if you keep being a garbage horse, man, no, I, I wouldn't do that to my friend. Even if he is trash at times. Alright. Okay, you know what? I really don't care that much. <laughs> I really don't care about this stupid chameleon that much. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, aggro, you're not even moving. Because there's like a pixel of a branch in the way, so forget you. No way to climb that. Oh, now aggro moves over here. Dude, it's easy. You just gotta go to the other side of this wall. I don't know why you can't do that. What are the shrines dedicated to? Um, probably nothing good. Okay, I couldn't just shoot it down. Rats. And then Aggro ran away for no... <laughs> He's like, Ag, you're shooting a bow! I'm scared! <laughs> Aggro's guilty. He knows I was gonna shoot him. Because of how slow he's been. The lizard is just hanging out in the in this shrubbery. I'm screwed. Like there's no way I can see him. What the heck was that? That lizard can freaking teleport, man. Like, that lizard can literally just teleport.
No, aggro's been useless kind of since the beginning. Maybe I just don't care for those. <sighs> well, my guy is becoming more and more brain dead as the game goes on. Okay. For crying out loud, where is that stupid freaking lizard? Uh, aim down the tunnel. No, aim down the tunnel. This would not happen if you were left-handed. Wow, the camera sucks. Take out the sword and stab it, you butt. How is it still alive? This is the real final boss of the game. How the heck is this lizard still alive? I've shot it like eight times. I know I said I don't care about this lizard, but at this point, I'm in too deep. If Aggro eats the lizard, I'm seriously ditching it. Where is the stupid lizard? Where is it? it was hanging out at the top. Wow, I'm so glad it took you five whole seconds to switch to the sword so you could let the lizard get away again. Finally! And now my horse disappeared. Can I warp back to the main temple area? Agra! It's definitely how you say your horse's name. Yeah, yeah it's like, come on, bro! Just go through... This closed off wall thing. I literally cannot. Yeah. We'll have to find another way around. Yeah. Can't be a Tom and Jerry skit. We don't have Tom's iconic scream. <laughs> yeah. Ah! Is that another freaking lizard? Or is that just like a normal old groundhog? Man, the plat the platforming in this game is just flawless. 
Never mind. Move aggro, move aggro, move aggro, move aggro. I sure hope this is the right direction because the game doesn't let me use the guidance here. This Colossus better be worth it. By the way, you're going the wrong way. Thanks for letting me only check that after I'd gone really far the wrong way. I appreciate it. Forget it, aggro. You are garbage. I already can tell there's going to be another freaking lizard here. Wait, is this the same flippin' shrine we were at? I don't think it is, but it looks like it's like they literally just ripped the exact same game model and copied it over here. Like, this is the same exact shrine. Don't care. Shrug it off. Walk it off. We're going this way. But, like, they didn't even remove, like, a tree or two. It was literally just, like, every last bit of it was exactly the same. I don't mind copying models, but, like, it, if you're trying to make the game look realistic, at least... And you put them right next to each other. That's the other thing. Like... It would be one thing if they were on, like, completely different parts of the map, but they weren't. Bro. You can grab onto that. Are you, are you serious? You can't grab onto that rock that very clearly is grabbable. See, like, look at this. Why can he not grab onto that? Why? It's like literally the only thing standing in the way of me reaching the area I need to, but no, he just refuses. Man, I hate that. I'm actually surprised we were able to jump up that. 
I fully expected some invisible barrier to push me down. Oh, like here. Like, you could easily walk up this in the real world. Like, easily. But oh no, it's kind of a sl deep slope. That is made of pure butter and a max speed conveyor belt. We cannot go on that. Breath of the Wild was also made way after this, and took like 10 years to make, so it's understandable. And probably had a way, way, way bigger team to work on it. Okay, this is, this is actually ridiculous. Everywhere I go, it's just like, no, you can't climb up this, no, you can't climb up this wall, no, oh, even though it looks like you can, you can't. And I need to go through this freaking wall. Like, no matter where I am on the map, it always points me to a wall saying you have to go through this. It's like it's domed off and you need to climb the wall to get it. But you try and it doesn't let you because there are invisible barriers that push you out. Gosh darn it, aggro! Again, I get on aggro for two seconds, realize that he's worthless, and figure it's better to go on foot. Like, come on! This is so frustrating that you can't go up ha And then you clip through that. Wow, are you... And then you get rocks like this... Wow! This is... <sighs> I mean, why do we need Elder Scrolls Six when Tom Howard did just such a good job on Skyrim? I mean, he made a flawless game. The barometer I use, I'm like, if I could climb something in real life, you can do it in a video game. I am not athletic, IRL, in the slightest. Yeah. Yeah. So, if I could do something athletic, I expect you to be able to do it in a game, unless I'm playing, like, the original Pac-Man. But, like, at this point, I'm lost. I don't know any way to go. Every single time I check where I need to go, it points me to a dead end. <laughs> what are you talking about? Skyrim was perfect. Especially the horse controls. Okay, we seem to be getting warmer. Thank you, Aggro. You have done almost nothing. Okay. So my compass was just pointing me in the wrong way, pretty much. Just gonna preemptively get out my bow, because I just have a hunch that's the weapon we'll be needing at the beginning.
Impossible. Lakes are myths. Geronimo! Oh, see? I could cannonball that time. <laughs> I've actually never played Skyrim, but I have watched people play Skyrim. It's a masterpiece. Oh, there we are. You know what? As long as you're a better fight than Georg from Majora's Mask, I think that's a win. And that's a low bar to go over, so... Ooh. Spooky. Hello, friend. Oh, that's like me in Fortnite. I still don't know what style of a game Fortnite is. Okay. Oh my gosh, bro, swim faster! Dude, you can grab onto that, you lunkhead. I don't think I'm actually doing anything to him. Wait, can you actually swim downwards? Um... <sighs> Is there a way to swim downwards and I don't remember? Because that's kind of going to be important to know. The dive button only seems to send me like one inch underwater. Okay, I didn't want you to hit me like that. I just want to grab onto you. Oh, oh. Well, I'm trying, but it's a little hard when my guy can only swim at, like, one meter a day. Dense lore. Well, unfortunately, I don't play games for the lore. I play games to have fun. It's cool if games have good lore, but... Okay. Here we go. Thankfully, we can breathe underwater here. Hey, pull out your sword, bro. Okay, where are the glowy spots? They're probably all at the front of the beast. Thank goodness he's swimming near the surface. All you would have to do is, like, swim deep underwater and, like, we're dead. <laughs> I 
I'd say that's probable. Aha! Alright, this boss scene, once you get on top of it, it seems much more straightforward than the last several we've done. Wow, like, this... Yeah, like, literally, once you're on his back, he can't really do anything to you. Because he's just like, oh no, something's on my back and killing me. I'd better just swim on the surface. Oh, never mind. Haha. <laughs> Now he's figured out, he's, wait a second, I can breathe underwater and swim deep, he can't. Spoke too soon. Hey bro, you know how to swim up, right? Oh, thank goodness. Look! I'm a little fish in the deep blue sea. <laughs> Don't you want to come and have a bite of me? <laughs> This is reminding me a little bit of, like, the aquatic monsters in Star Wars Episode One. But in a good way, because I actually like Star Wars Episode One. Have a lot of nostalgia for that movie. <laughs> There's always a bigger fish. I have a feeling if you tried to fight an aquatic monster like this in real life, it probably wouldn't go nearly this well. Thank goodness this fiend has hair on its back. Otherwise, we'd be in big doo-doo this time. Well, that's not very nice. Carlos, how could you? That part might be a wee bit dangerous. Aha! Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh! Oh, shoot. I got a little too greedy there. Oh! Fatality! <laughs> oh. Don't you feel bad for killing this fish? Not really, no. My good friend Nimrod told me it was okay, so... 
that's what we're doing. Man, it's a lovely day for a swim, you know? I just thought it would be nice to spend a day at the lake, have a cool dip in the pool, refresh myself after a long day of work. Man, I gotta say, this is really, really calming, and this is just a very nice- <laughs> Moby Dick, don't you mean Dicky Mo? <laughs> Tom and Jerry. Man, Tom and Jerry would be great. Jerry.